In this video, I'm going to be discussing how to calculate normal probabilities and percentiles using example 6.10 from the Introductory Statistics Open Stats book, which is available for free via this link. Okay, and I'm going to be using Excel as my calculator. Um, if you want step-by-step -step instructions of how to use a graphing calculator, they do go through that in this textbook. Uh, the steps to using Excel are very similar to using the graphing calculator. All right, let's go ahead and start by reading through the problem. So in the United States, the ages 13 to 55 of smartphone users approximately follow a normal distribution. Okay, so the ages follow a normal distribution with approximate mean and standard deviation of 36.9 years and 13.9 years. So if X were the ages of smartphone users, then X follows a normal distribution with mean 36.9 and standard deviation 13.9. Right, so this first parameter here is mu or mean, the second parameter is sigma or standard deviation. Okay, so determine the probability that a random smartphone user in the age range 13 to 55 is between 23 and 64.7. So between 23 and 64.7 years old. All right, so let's draw out the normal distribution first. In the center of this normal distribution is always the mean. The mean here is 36.9. Okay, and what we're trying to find out is what's the probability that X is between 23 and 64.7. Okay, so 23, it's some number less than 36, so it's down here, 23. And 64, it's greater than 36, so it's somewhere up here. Okay, this is not drawn to scale, but it's just approximate. Okay, and what we want to know is basically we want to know this area between, right? The probability that X is between 23 and 64.7, right? But we know that all calculators, Excel and your graphing calculator, they always calculate cumulative probabilities. So cumulative probabilities are the probability that X is strictly less than some number, okay? So if I were to start by figuring out what's the probability that X is less than 64.7, that would be all of this area to the left of 64.7, right? And that's too much. So what I'll have to do to find that blue, that between probability, I'll have to subtract off the probability that X is less than 23. Subtract off this tail. All right. Okay, so the probability that x is between 23 and 64.7 is the probability that x is less than 64.7 minus the probability that x is less than 23. Great, and those are both cumulative probabilities. So now I can go to Excel and calculate this. Okay, so I'm gonna type equals norm dot dist open parentheses start with 64.7 all right and the mean the mean of this distribution was 36.9 the standard deviation was 13.9 and always true for cumulative true then write minus norm dot dist open parentheses now do 23 okay same mean, 36.9, standard deviation 13.9, and always true. Okay, now just press enter, and there you go. There's the probability. I can round that to 0.82. Okay. So this equals 0.82. All right, great, that's my answer to part A. Now let's move on to part B. Determine the probability that a randomly selected smartphone user in the age range 13 to 55 is at most 50.8 years old. So let me go ahead and scroll down so we can have more room to figure out the answer to this question. So I'm gonna, again, I'm gonna draw my distribution. And in the center of this normal distribution is always the mean, 36.9. Right, and I want to find the probability that X is at most 50.8. Right, 
And what's the symbol here? Is it less than? Is it greater than? What is it? Well, at most, what does that mean? So if here is 50.8, can x be more than 50.8 if it's at most 50.8? No, no, you can't be 60. 60 would be more than 50.8, and that's not at most. Could you be less than? Yeah, right, because less than 50.8 would be at most 50.8. If you're 40, then you're still fitting within that range at most 50.8. So at most means less than, less than 50.8. All right, so I basically want to know what's this probability to the left of 50.8. Oh, that's so convenient now, right? Because that is basically a cumulative probability. Cumulative probabilities, remember, always calculate the probability to the left. So I can go to into Excel and calculate this. Let me delete this, and then I'll type enter norm.dist, and I'll write 50.8. The mean is 36.9. And the standard deviation is 13.9. Always type true for cumulative, close parentheses, and then press enter. All right, so there we go. If I were to round that to two decimal places, 0 0.84. 0 0.84. The probability that a randomly selected smartphone user is at most 50.8 years old is 0.84. Okay. Last question, find the 80th percentile of this distribution and to interpret it in a complete sentence. All right, so let me go ahead and once again, let me draw the distribution. Always, I always draw where the center is, 36.9. All right, 80th percentile, what does that mean? That means 80% is less than whatever the 80th percentile is. Right, percentiles is, are always giving you the number or the percent less than, okay? So 80%, if I draw a line here and say 80% is down here, does that make sense? No, that's that's gonna be a small, small amount is in here because remember, right here, that's half of the distribution, right? Less than the middle or less than the mean is half of the distribution. So that's 50% there in the center. So it's gotta be over here somewhere over here to the right. This is 80%, right? Some large amount over here to the right of the mean. Okay, and I'll, I'll just use the letter K. I don't know what it is, but I know that 80% is less than whatever this number K is, 0 0.80. Okay, to figure out what is K, I can use Excel. So let me go here, delete this. I'm gonna type enters norm dot Instead of dist, it's going to be INV, inverse. Open parentheses. The probability to the left is 0 0.80. The mean is still 36.9. The standard deviation is 13.9. Close parentheses, press enter, and voila. They give you the answer, 48.598. Eight. So I can round that to 48.6. 48.6. All right, and if you were to write a sentence that describes what this 48.6 represents, you would say that 80% um, of smart phone users ages 13 to 55 plus are less than, less than 48, 48.6 years old.